In this video, I'm going to show you how the autopilot of new version is going to work under the latest uh, software version, Banyan 2.4.5. Um, now I only have 4% battery uh, left over. I placed a battery swap order, so I'm going to let the vehicle drive from here to the station. Uh, it's around roughly 4.6 kilometers. It takes about 12 minutes. So I'm going to let the vehicle go by itself, but uh, if I have to take over, I take over. So let's see how it goes. I'm going to take the seat belt out. Okay, let's go. So it's not activated yet. I have to go back to the main lane and they have up to maybe 20 kilometers per hour speed. So I'm gonna activate it by pushing this button. Okay, now it's open. We see that, uh, that means it's on the autopilot version. So we see a red headlight ahead. See how it goes for this turn, right? So it's slowing down, turning on the signal. Making the right turn, not too bad. A bit overturned, but uh, worked. We're gonna make a left turn ahead. So we picked up the middle lane, also the left turn. You see that uh, on my HUD, I can see all very brief thing. Uh, there and it's very convenient I don't have to really look at the panel here it's showing on the, on the screen okay turning left smooth okay okay we can left turn I know it's gonna go back on the right side because that is a left turn lane. Okay, so that's something you need to optimize. It's just a waste of time. I have to make sure my hand is holding on the wheel, or it's gonna warn me. Okay. I'm not anxious about the battery life here because in 3.5 kilometers I'm going to have a 93% battery swapped in 3 minutes so no worry about battery life at all I set a 10% um, up speed range for the uh, above the speed limit that's why it's it's driving at 66 km per hour at this moment so you rec recognize the speed limit of this road okay didn't recognize there's a left lane here so I have to take over a little bit Slowing down for the red light. Okay. But the, the lane ahead of us is a left turn, so it's gonna, when the green light is on, it's gonna go to the right lane. So in that case, I'm gonna give it a big gas. So making sure I'm, I'm on, on the right speed. Or I guess the vehicle is gonna stuck in front because that's the 
the left lane ahead of us. My order for the battery swap is already placed. Um, almost. Whenever I'm, I'm approaching to the station, it's gonna go for a uh, placed order. So it's order awaiting at this moment. So. I manually signaled the right turn and the vehicle did it by itself. Okay, I'm gonna accelerate and go to the left lane because I know that. So I turn the signal, it will do it by itself or it will do it uh, somewhere later near the, the crossing over there. It's warning me that I was uh, holding up the gas, the, the pedal. So, ask me to release from it. Okay, it's going to go into the left turn. Okay. It didn't recognize the red light here. It was misrecognized that the uh, um, U-turn signal. So I have to break. I had to had a, a full break to stop it, and the uh, autopilot just exited. I have to uh, turn it back on when I um, when this red uh, green light is on. So currently there are two batteries available out of fifteen. Um, the rest are charging, so should be able to swap one right after I um, arrived at the best the, the the battery station. Okay, we also recognize the this, the last seconds. Okay, I'm gonna. Okay. Going back to autopilot. And in the waiting zone, we will stop. It, it recognizes that the waiting zone um, drawing there. Okay. I just uh, break this so it. Exit it again. Okay, turning back now. Some construction area in the, the head, so it asked me to take it over. So I took it over here. Yeah. It can recognize something on the construction, um, not matching the, 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 the navigation on the map, but uh, sometimes I have to take it over. So, okay, now let's turn it back on. Very close to the entrance of the the park the parking zone. Okay, asking me to do the right turn manually. So I do it manually. But we are already arriving here. Okay. Okay. Let's try if I can get it back up. Okay. 
so it's in the in this um in this battery uh, station area it's it's not a full autopilot mode so it's just following some um yeah it's just stuck here so let me okay not the right place so I have to uh, go back I think the navigation was wrong there was some um, construction took place and uh, the, the way was blocked let me see other place okay no nope. about here maybe this way let's try this way This way is working. Okay, almost there. Okay, order is placed. Nobody is ahead of me, so I will go straight to the battery station and uh, do the battery swap right here. Okay. I'm gonna park in the designated spot right here. Okay. Start. Battery swap is begun. Okay. Oh, right. In the spot. Okay, I'm gonna start the power swap. Preparing. Please wait. You see that? 2% left over. Let's wait for the magic in three minutes. Swap is about to start. During this time, vehicle may shake and make noise. This is normal. Do not open any door, shift gears, or press brake pedal. This is the latest uh, battery uh, station. The word uh, generation three, the third generation. So, I I can barely feel any um, shaking or movement during the battery swap so it's just uh, minimized and on the screen it's showing that uh, what this uh, process is doing at this moment so the ball is losing I see the I can hear the sound the old battery is taking over it's being removed
the old battery is already removed. The new battery is engaging. Just feel it in stored. Okay. Almost there. This is the final self inspection. The diagnostic and make sure that everything works well. And uh, we see that red light is gonna turn green shortly. All right, it's great now. Taking a few more seconds for the vehicle to restart. Okay. 93 percent 464 kilometers in three minutes overall i think this um all the pilot feature is usable for um regular uh, traffic or just if there's no traffic at all it's gonna be great we don't have really to pay much attention uh, to it or it will always warn us if there's some issue about it but for heavy traffic, it's not really that good yet. Uh, let's see how it goes um, in the future. I'm gonna keep shooting it.